my dad uh, loved people so he would bring in relatives at home mm -hmm. like all the time but unfortunately he would bring in male relatives uh, and uh, we would sleep in the same house and uh, i remember those we, this one particular one the f very first one that came uh, and he sexually abused me and I never talked about it, but he didn't stay for long. Mm. He stayed for about, uh, I think, two to three months, then he left. How old were you? I was in class two. Yeah. And then when I was in class three, he brought in another relative mm. now, a very close one. Huh? And uh, at that time, the relative was a pastor then, and he continued with the sexual abuse. A pastor? So, yeah. He continued with the sexual abuse and I remember I, I used to tell him, uh, he used to tell me that if you happen to talk about this to anyone, oh my God, the kind of prayers I'm going to pray, your life will be miserable. So I wouldn't talk about it. And you can imagine the sexual abuse went on from class three all through class eight. And there's a time when I was in class six now, I was tired and now I was like, I, I, I'm not able to tell my dad this. You see, I'm the firstborn. I'm not even able to tell my sister. Then I told myself, I think I'd rather die. So I went and took some uh, puritons, okay, with my mind as a baby that time. You were in standard eight? Yeah, I was in class six mm -hmm. that time. Oh, six? Yeah, class okay. six now. I took puritons, like a whole, a whole carton. Was it a carton? No, a jerry can. I took puritons. Oh, my God. And after taking them, I went and slept. So when I was sleeping, I, I had my dad calling, like, Nancy, Nancy. And I'm like, ah, Nancy. And then I saw myself, I saw myself coming out of me. Like, I saw myself mm. coming out of me. Mm. And I went and stood next to my dad. And my dad is still calling. And now I'm wondering, Kwani, this guy is not seeing me. Then I was calling him and telling him, Dad, I'm here. But now my dad was not listening. And then I felt those danger because I looked and I saw Nancy sleeping on the bed. So I started calling out, Dad, Dad, I mean, Nancy, Nancy. So my dad rushed out of the house and went outside the window to call me, and I followed him. So wait, so your spirit <coughs> left your body? Is yeah. that what I'm hearing? Yeah, uh -huh. my spirit left my body, and I could see it. So outside the window again, my dad was calling, and I'm also calling, and I'm seeing myself lying on that bed. And remember, I'm still a young girl. I've, I've never experienced such kind of a thing. I was not even born again at that time, so I was not understanding anything. But I called Nancy until I woke up. And when I woke up, I, I, I found my dad now already in the bedroom and he was so furious. Like, how can you even sleep during the day? And now I wanted to explain to him that this is what has been happening. But now he was not giving me the chance to talk. And then I shut up again. So the sexual abuse went on until, um, until I completed class eight. Huh? So hold on. So uh, you're, how many siblings are you? Four. You're four. Firstborn. Yeah. So you definitely couldn't tell the younger ones. No. No. Because mm -mm. uh, the pastor kept intimidating you with, uh, you know, praying evil prayers mm -hmm. towards you mm -hmm. and your life. Mm -hmm. And your mom was in the village. My Were mom, you visiting yeah. her? No. She would come, but uh -huh. at that time she never came. She didn't come like all through. Okay. And mm -hmm. you still couldn't tell her? I couldn't tell her, but we talk on phone, but I couldn't tell her. Because of the fear that mm -hmm. had been plugged into I you. I was also afraid if my dad would find out, yeah. he would, I, I was afraid of how he would react. And then I was also afraid of the, the, the things that he would do to me, like, you know, we are lawyers. And that is incest. So I was afraid what, would, what, what they would do to me. So I didn't want to talk about it. Then you went to high school and what happened there? Now, when I went to high school, another pro problem began. Mm. I started bedwetting. And it was so bad, I, 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 I started bedwetting from Form 1 to Form 4 because of what was happening to me back then. And, you know, the other, the other students would laugh at me, but they, they wouldn't understand what, what, what was going on. Mm. But I was okay because now no one was sexually molesting me. Yeah. So me, I was fine. In fact, I was so okay. They don't know my home. They mm. don't know me. We just meet in school and that's it. Mm. So that is the kind of problem I went through mm. in high school. For four years? <coughs> For four years. Okay. And not just in high school, even in one of my marriages. Okay. One yeah. of your marriages.